Okay guys, good morning. Clean ball striking. It can put you in the zone and it can really raise your confidence level. On the other hand, miss hits and off-center hits can really hurt your confidence. Your confidence can start to wane. Now, if we start to hit off-center and miss hit, sure we're taking our eye off the ball but there's something a little more than that that I'd like to talk about today. Um, the head is the key point. If your head looks up during the swing, remember in science class they taught us for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction? Well, you're in the middle of your swing, you're just about to hit the ball, you look up because you're a little anxious to see where your shot goes, and that movement of the head, remember every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction, causes the racket to move. And that's why you get the miss hits. So um, that's really the root cause of miss hits and off-center hits. It's the movement of the head during the swing. The solution, simply keep telling yourself to keep the head still during the swing. Now this is something you have a hundred percent control over. This is part of your technique. So when you focus and concentrate on those things that you have a hundred percent control over, you're going to get into the zone more often, you're going to perform your best more often. So I'll just go through a little practice demo on what I would do if I'm working on that point. Okay, here we go. I'm just going to work. This happens a lot on return of serve, especially, but it can happen during rallies as well. You're a little anxious. You want, is your opponent coming to the net or whatever? And you look up just that fraction, your head moves, that causes you to miss hit. So I've got a buddy here. He's going to hit me some serves. We'll play out a few points from the baseline. And then uh, now during this whole time, I'm only focusing on that one point, keeping my head still during the swing. Here we go. All right, I'm concentrating on keeping the head still. Okay, that was good. That's good, Tom. Keep the head still. That's the key right now. Okay, good. So that's the idea, just keeping that head still, concentrating on that. Just focusing on that. Oh, good get, Thomas. One more here. Head still. That's all I'm focusing on. That's a little... No. All right. How well did I do right there? Not that well. I think I, I did move the head a little. So, check in. After every point, how well did I do on that point? Did I focus on keeping the head still? The key is, if you're getting miss hits or off-center hits, it's the movement of the head. That's the root cause. So work on that. Remember, you have 100% control on your mechanics and what you're doing with your head during your swing. When you concentrate on those things, you're going to get into the zone more often. You're going to play your best. Have a good one. Hey, remember, focus on the ball right up to the contact area. I say contact area because many times players may say, well, I'm going to try and watch the ball hit the strings. But you, you really can't see the ball hit the strings. It's a millisecond happening. It's happening too fast. 
Actually, the last time your eyes will see the ball, when the ball is about four feet away from the contact point. So the net right now would represent the last time I see the ball. Many times you'll look in a tennis magazine and you'll see the player like this with the ball on the strings and their eyes are focused right out there about where the net is because that's the last time they saw it. You won't see them like this. If you try and do this, it's too quick of an eye movement to move your head like that. And actually that movement of the head can cause miss hits. So don't try and watch it too close. Just follow it up nicely to about four feet away from the contact point. That's the last time you'll see it right there. And then remember, keep your head still as you finish.